class is now in session. We're in a professional office building. I don't know where I'm going. <laughs> I was like going in circles. Oh, I'm going here though. Just kidding. Maybe I use the restroom, but I'm gonna say no. Because I'm fabulous. <laughs> oh, this is probably my room. The fan room. Are all my fans in there? Oh. It's locked. Can't go in there anyways. Okay, look at all these corridors. Mm, this is very, very business-like. Podcast warmed up. Oh, I see it. I see it. There we go. Quietest podcast ever. Yeah, no one's talking. Everyone be quiet. What's your motivation? <laughs> How do you do, you two? I just record. Sounds good. Okay, bye. Bye. We're at Versace. A little sneak peek of it. I'll do an unboxing. So cute. And use sunglasses. My scissors over there. So bad, but it's the holidays and they have pink everywhere. I'm dying. South Coast Plaza. They're such a. Wait, what the hell is. Mm -hmm. Hey guys, today I'm going to be cleaning my own house because my regular maids don't respond. So I'm in Target buying cleaning supplies. I'm going to get this because it says squirt. I'm gonna try and get one thing from each section because my house is really dirty. Dish soap because I cook my own food. These are colorful, so we're gonna get lots of these. Sour Daddy. So mommy needs a scrub and Daddy needs a scour. Mr. Queen is sexy. <laughs> There's so many dusters to choose from. I'll get this one because it looks like an orange Julius. Ooh. Vinegar. Ooh. Clean shower. <gasps> I need the things that clean my toilet because I got rings in my toilet. Four ounce vapes because I'm all out of beef wipes. We'll use, we'll use a little bit of dish soap, I guess, since we are in the kitchen. in here. <laughs> we're inside. The heat camera's here, but we're inside. Going into rooms. I won't film the room in black room, don't worry. I'm so tired. Kicked my butt. Oh, I love it.
this trainer though. This trainer is like really good because we're always doing different stuff. He pushes me, I sweat, I drip. I have like three towels that I use when I work out. So, I'm so tired. Oh, I honestly could like die right now. I'm so tired, but it's a good workout, I guess. Okay, got it locked in for next week's schedule. <sighs> Things are going good. My shoulders and my butt kill me, and I love it. <laughs> Eric, this is seriously the creepiest bathroom ever. Seriously, looks like you could get murdered. Everything is like open except for these two are closed, and it reminds me of Scream when he was like standing on the toilet. I'm actually gonna get out of here. Oh my god. I always feel like I'm gonna get killed in the movie theater bathroom. So creepy. Anyways, movie's still going on. I just really had to go to the bathroom. It's really not that good anyways, but I don't really want to walk out of it because I was like, oh my god, I'm going to miss something. So then I knew I'd like be sad, but like, creepy. Hello? That's how you do in a horror movie. You just go on an escape. Hello? Chillin' while they take care of parking. Boys taking care of parking. Can you see my light up shell? I look greasy too. Oh my god, I just booked an amazing makeup artist for my shoot on Saturday. My other one canceled on me last minute. So I booked an even better one and I'm so so stoked about it. So yeah, now we're getting ready to record. I'm tired. Looks like I have a uniboop. <laughs> I did not think I was gonna like it. And a dog done it the whole time that the previews were coming out and the trailer, but it was so good. <laughs> it made me really happy, especially the musical number at the end. Okay, but guys, I'm like, like, literally like cracking up. You'll see this in my lazy day routine, but I got summer clothes and swimsuits and cute nighties. Target is where it's at. <laughs> it's so pretty in here. Oh my gosh. That is so pretty. You can take a picture in front of the tree. You guys, this is so pretty in here. That's where I get my hair done. Oh my god. Whoa. This is gorgeous. I kind of want to come here just for like dinner or something. This is so pretty. Oh my god, I love it. Christmas is so magical. It's so pretty right now. I get my um, hair done at the Montage Beverly Hills where Justin Bieber lives. <laughs> Never. Actually, you know what? I have seen him. I've seen him here once, but it wasn't, he wasn't even like surrounded by a bunch of people, but he was like in a hoodie, but I knew it was Justin Bieber. Yeah, so getting my hair done. Ubered it here, oh, called the water department. They said it has to be a leak. Oh my God, this is one thing after the other, but Christmas spirit makes me happy, so I'm not gonna let that get me down. I'm in the men's section of Target right now. These pajamas are so cute. I wish I had them in small. So cute. Look how comfortable those are. <laughs> I mean, they look comfortable. So we just saw, um, I mean, there's so much gay pride stuff here. I love it. It's like a whole rainbow section. Um, anyways, we just saw, oh my god, these are cute too. Pajamas so cute. Oh my god, can I just like finish? I got so many clothes in there. That's what I'm getting when I was trying on her clothes. Got cute dresses and pants and all that stuff. But, anyways, we saw the gift and it was really good. And we were really scared the whole time. I was like grabbing out of my mom. I just like men's shirts better. So I'm in the men's section like a creeper. Um, just gonna pretend that I'm looking. Mm, I'm sure so comfortable. Um, it was really good, and the ending was crazy, but I called it. About midway, I called it. I won't spoil it, but I, I thought I was pretty good. I was very proud of myself for calling it. But, yeah, we actually came to get Gatorade, because they were drinking this, like, green Gatorade in the movie. And that's why we came here, so. Um, oh, I don't know why I'm leaving. My mom's trying on clothes. I guess she could find me, but get that. Guys' clothes are so cute. I wish they made guys' clothes for girls. But I guess girls could wear them. We should be gender neutral here at Target. Those are cute. I want this whole outfit. So cute. 
Oh, it's going green. Oh no, hers is green. Mine is red. Green. Yeah. Oh, there it is. Mm. This is fine. How to find a new place to get. I look wrecked up. I've been moving all day, but how to find a new place to get pedicure. I'm fix my nail. So, yeah. Been moving all day. That's why I look crazy. Gotta go home and shower. See how it goes. Gave my nails off for like a week. Let them breathe. Got a little Robert De Niro right there. Are you talking to me? <laughs> Alright guys, here is the after. Got some like vampire blood red. I'm matching on my toes. I'll show you the other hand. Looks very like Halloween-ish. Wanna show your nails, Mom? I gotta just show you the time it is right now because <laughs> it's 1.17 in the morning. And I'm on the toilet. And I'm not doing anything on the toilet other than sitting. Because if I get off the toilet for one minute, I have to get back on it because it feels like I have to pee so freaking bad. This is the most painful, painful thing I've ever experienced. It is so annoying and even when I'm sitting on the toilet, it still feels like I have to pee and I can't. And in my vagina just wants to pee so bad and I can't. Thank God for Postmates, my Postmates woman. Thank God, bless her so much. I'm getting probiotics and Azo, Azow. I literally was looking up stuff on the internet about like, I look crazy. Or like instant UTI relief because I have never had this pain before. This like, or I guess I've never had a UTI before because I've never experienced this. So last night it started a little bit, like I had this happen, but I was able to go back to sleep, no problem. And throughout the whole day today, nothing. And now all of a sudden, from like 11 o'clock to now, one in the morning, I can't stop having to pee. So I took some cranberry. I had cranberry pills upstairs, thank God. So I'm going to just take those every single day. And now I'm going to get some urinary tract relief. It's called Azo, A-Z-O. And then I got some probiotics. And I'm just going to have to like overdose. Well, not literally overdose, but take so much of those. Because I cannot sleep. And this hurts so bad. Literally the worst pain I've ever ever felt so much discomfort <sighs> this, this shit hurts so bad i would not wish this on my worst enemy i've never been in more pain this takes the cake <laughs> these are what i took i just happened to have these i took like three of these but you should be taking them daily i guess to prevent this stuff all right guys it says to take two tablets three times a day so, as much as needed, and this is all that comes in this pack. So we're gonna see how fast this relief really does work because it is right now 1.40 a.m. And I just, ha I had to run to the bathroom like as soon as she got here again because I felt like I had to pee. And I did it, and it hurt so bad. All right, so let's get these little things out. <laughs> They're really tiny pills. It says it may cause your urine to be orange. I need to drink with a full glass of water. All right, let's see how fast these work. Says you should take them with a meal if your stomach becomes upset. But it's like two in the morning, what am I gonna eat? Take my chances, I'd rather have an upset stomach than this painful urination. Sorry guys, I literally was like sleeping prior to this. But now I'm up. You take it three times daily, so 24 hours in a day, every eight hours. So I can take some in the morning, hopefully this this goes away by then. I was literally looking at my pantry for something to eat. I have nothing. I have like gross like snack foods that sound terrible right now, including so I'm opening a fresh jar of peanut butter because I just want one scoop and then I feel like that'll make it better. There are two chests when I lay down because that's when it seems to always have to like go to the bathroom. As soon as I get comfy back in my sheets. Oh, my 
Where's that smart? He's got a white man. Mm -mm. That was a really bad idea. Um, but it's really awesome. I'm really happy. And I'm really tired. So I am going to go to bed, but I really wanted to go look through the footage because I was, I just want to see how it turned out and stuff with the underwater cam, and I think it turned out really cool. So if you guys haven't checked it out, go check it out. I think I'm going to call it Turks and Caicos Power Snorkeling. So maybe go check that out if you guys want to on my main channel. Maybe I'll link it below. Flip. I'll see. But I love you guys so much. And again, sorry I'm like, actually my voiceover I think probably was very soothing because I can't really hear. But um, yeah. Okay, I'm going to take you with us to Puerto Rico tomorrow. Um... I don't have an excursion booked because it's uh, there's zip lining and I don't I can't do that yet. I'm in bad adventures, but we'll see what we do. I'm so happy to be here with my family right now. It's just it's really cool. I'm really glad I get to experience these things because Trish in the Bahamas, um, like this private island thing, which I'm really excited about. So um, love them, and I have a cruise haul because I bought a bunch of stuff, but. I think I'm gonna buy some more stuff tomorrow. But I love you guys so much. Thank you for watching. I hope you guys are enjoying these vlogs and these videos. Oh, there's my shadow. Ooh, that's a cool shadow. That could be like a t-shirt. Trish, Trish. <laughs> um. I was like, oh, did you forget something? So I said Shane. And I heard someone like respond to me. And I don't believe in ghosts, guys, at all. But I tell you what, like, I fucking heard someone's talk. And then when I said Shane, someone replied to like hello it was so weird i know it was there so i'm a little freaked out but scared um that was weird maybe it's in my head i don't know but why would that be in my head oh my god thank god my brother and my sister are not coming to stay with me tomorrow i always get like freaked out and i will sleep with like this light on tonight because i always get like a little freaked out and when i was younger i always slept with the lights on is that weird like, I'm not sensitive to light. Like, I can pass out in, like, a fully lit room, like, or, like, the bright TV on. And that's what I do tonight. I hate the fact that, like, oh, my room is so, like, discombobbled. Am I the only one who's like that? Like, when you're not completely satisfied with your home living surroundings, you just don't feel like yourself. Like, I, I don't feel put together with makeup or hair. I just, like, everything's everywhere. Ugh, I got in this weird kick to change everything, and then I immediately regretted it. I was like, mm, girl, just, just loved it as it was. <sighs> I go to bed, guys. Thank you, guys, for watching so much. I had a stomachache. I had so much candy and popcorn and caramel popcorn and food. <sighs> I'm honestly so sick. I look so sick. I literally look like death. Okay, guys, I'm going to go ahead and go. Uh, hi to Miranda's, and until next time, come back and see us tomorrow.